watch. This is the unveiling of Kodos Mohammed, our international superstar, born and bred in Nima. He played for Ayaz. But before that, Right to Dream Academy is, is beginning. And now we have him recently. He scored his first international UEFA goal, September, with Rangers. And today, we have him here, but I'm sure tomorrow or on Friday, our next match, Kodos will have two more goals, inshallah. We're basically are combining forces and is trying to honor our brother, Kudus Mohammed, who is actually doing wonders in, in, in the World Cup at the, in Qatar. So, aside that, we're also here to support our brother, Mohammed Aoudou, who is one of the finest graffiti artists in Africa, do his thing. And once he's, Mohammed Aoudou is from Nima, Mohammed Kudus too is from Nima. Guys like us are also like us also are from Nima. So we thought it wise to be able to come together, join our forces and strength, join our forces and strength to honor our brother. And what we could do is that we can't pay him, we can't give him, but to also sort of like show admiration and show him to the world, which is giving doing a graffiti of him in our community, basically. And the more reason why we're here. You can see behind me is the morale painting of Kudus Mohammed. Kudus Mohammed, a young gentleman from Nima, at the age of 10, he joined um, a particular team and then they made sure that when he joined Right to Dream, look at the name, Right to Dream, this gentleman did all he can and then found himself in the Danish league with Netherland. From there, he's now with Hayas. And trust me, as we speak right now, he's with the national team. He just scored two goals. Kudus Mohammed is an inspiration to the Zongo youth. So this is where we're doing this morale to be able to inspire the young ones. We have a lot of talent. One of the finest ones we've had in Ghana's football history is Mohamed Polo. And this gentleman is from Nima. Name them, the, all the big stars, the Isaka, Audu, all those players came from Nima. So it is only appropriate to celebrate them whilst they are alive. The Zongo community is composed of many diverse people. And um, out of the chaos, you find really disciplined people. And um, our main go-to is football. That is what we entertain ourselves with. That is, that is our happiness. Every morning you find kids playing football after school. You find kids playing football. That is our getaway because the house is choked. It means that out of the hundreds and thousands of young people, there is talent. And if you get inspiration and you get mentorship, then products such as Kudus becomes a household name. We just need a little bit of guidance, a little bit of um, support um, and investment. And I tell you what, the number of youth that will come out of the Zungu communities will be marvelous. People like Samuel um, Oseko Four, people like um, Sule Muntari, name them. Um, they're all Zungu products. That tells you that it's a huge potential that the country can actually milk from if given the needed attention. It's a great thing that happens to us. One of us is excelling out there and we are very proud of him. That's why one of our brother too, one of the best artists in the world, not in Africa self currently, is doing wonders here. So that tells you that we are happy. That's why you see a number of people are out here to come and celebrate our brother. My memory of Kudus is, is a boy that is a go-getter from infancy. He doesn't, he, doesn't, he doesn't give up. He feels like, yeah, he can do it. And these are the things. We have a number of Kudus in the community number of kudus but just because they don't have help they don't have like they, we don't have enough pitches for them to excel to to express their talent i know mohammed kudus since he was 12 playing so i i see his talent and his capabilities and what he's doing right now we, we saw it way back what kudus is doing right now we saw it but a lot of people didn't see it you understand for me like this i can talk about him because i see him playing from under 12, 13, 14, before Right to Dream came. You understand? So what he's doing right now, we are most grateful to Allah. You understand? So we are happy. Yeah. So he just had the thoughts of Mohamed Kudus' friends and also some of his fans here in Nima. So anytime you pass on the stretch of Kaukudi, just know that you can catch a glimpse of Mohamed Kudus' mural here in Nima. Reporting for Ghana Web, my name is Joseph Adamafio, Accra, Ghana. Mm -hmm.